should be. Alright. I really like this game. I think it's fun. I think it's a quick little play. Again, I got it free from Amazon, so like no no loss. Uh, there's a whole backstory here, but I'm not sitting through. Basically, the Black King, I think, is racist or something like that and wants to go on a genocide. <laughs> I am a king, but I have a shotgun. You take damage whenever ever you you accidentally click a square that is a legal move for one of White's pieces. My goal is to kill the king. Yeah. Yeah, you can't be in, in, uh, and so, you can shoot them, but you take damage. The, you, it won't let you move your king into a position where another player can take you for two turns. You see those two little shields I have at the top? That's my health. Um, if I take too much damage and I mess up, it just lets the turn pass and I lose. Speaking of which, I'm going to move this around. Come here, uh, hot tub goal. I, I'm really ambitious with this hot tub goal, let me tell you. Um, okay, and so then after you do the first round, you get cards that let you get a buff or a debuff, but it also gives white a buff in some degree. Um, hello there, Enfys. How are you today? You just missed Stumble, guys. I literally... No, no. I'm, I'm landing Enfys. I, like, I, I literally just turned off uh, Stumble, guys, to play some of this. Uh, the moat. None. I actually really like the moat. The moat's good. Remove one king, add one bishop. Bishops have plus two HP. Uh, piercing truth, your bullets have a 30% to, uh, chance to pierce. Add two knights after 15 turns. Right arm's not... Were you going... Were you using it that much? That, that, that's a joke. <laughs> um, and so I also get these cards that... Um, uh, your butt been bad for two months. <laughs> You can't win. Um, that lets you move like another piece on the board. We're just gonna straight up kill. Oh wait, it turns the bishops into kings? Okay, that's an issue. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling pinned in over here. There we go. No, no, I won. That was a good thing. <laughs> but spot, no. Uh, shooting moves you... I, I've had this card before. I do not like it. I do like this one. Oh, but I don't think I have the Nightbane. I don't think I have this weapon, so it might not do me any good. We'll just deal with the, the knockback. Not inaccurate, to be honest. <laughs> Oh my gosh, how does he have so many bishops already? Oh my gosh, I'm stuck, aren't I? No, I can, I can, oh yeah, I am stuck. Here, here's where I wanted to go. I didn't like the card. I I didn't like the cards I had. Uh, got to a point I couldn't open and close your hand. Oh, I mean, 
you you really rest it. Have you have you been have you looked up any like and this isn't me making any silly, funny, or dumb jokes. Have you looked up any like physical therapy things you could try? So I do quite a few, um, but I also have to reload sometimes. You're do, doing physiotherapy? Okay. Uh, pawn can attack you. Flip this card if a pawn is killed. Add one pawn every five turns. That's not so bad. Add one bishops. Bishops can move, not attack diagonally. Uh, add three pentagrams. I think I will take this. Because it's more... I'm, I'm not crazy about this card, but I don't want... Pawns are pretty easy to deal with, that they're not a worry for me. No, there's a, a limit to it. Can't go there. I need to retreat a bit. Uh, can't go there. Can't go there. Can go there. Can go there. Can go there. Oh, you know what? I was looking at this thinking it was a bishop, not the knight. I got it. Noogie noogie. Coffee? Uh, I could go for coffee, but... I'm, I really can't. Brian had a coffee. He's gonna be up all night. When's the Maple Leafs next game? Hey, Siri, when's the next Minus one fire range. Uh, protects from death once per turn. Huh. Uh, plus two firepower. Flip this card if your king is not on the edge of the board. No, I think it's... Tum no, it might be... Yeah, Saturday. So 1 a.m. Uh, why don't you come... <laughs> Sicily, uh, Infix needs your attention. Uh, remove two pawns, add one rock. <sighs> one pawn, uh... <sighs> I don't like either of these cards for me. They're not great cards, but I'll take pawns over him having a rook. Okay, uh, shooting moves you back on. Non king pieces can't come near your king. We'll go with that. And they get a queen. There's this is unavoidable. So I'm getting queens. Hmm. Oh, I didn't see that. All right, we'll just shoot. Can't go there. I can't go. Can't go there. Can't go there. Can't go here. Huh? They got me trapped, don't they? I don't like it. Uh, 
let me fire. I was hoping I could fire. Um, I can't go there. 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 Uh, I'm just fucking bone. I tried to shoot the knight. It wouldn't let me. But I get a revive. I forgot about that. Oh, but I still need a reload. God damn it. I, I need to reload. Oh, I can't go there. Um, I was boned. It, it put me in a bad spot. That's alright. These are quick... Oh, I can take as much time as I want. I'm just impatient. It just gets tricky because as the cards add on, if you're not paying attention, it really messes you up. Um, plus one, flip the card if there's no knight on the board. Plus one, speed, bishops, or pawns and bishops get plus one speed. Flip card if there's no bishop on the board. Plus one ammo regeneration, plus one firing range. Move one king, add one bishop. Uh, bishops plus two. Win if all bishops are dead. Alright, we'll, we'll go with that. Okay, so bishops are kings now. So I gotta kill both of them. But... I get additional firepower. Drive by. Uh, plus two fire power. Flip, uh, flip the card if your king is not on the board's edge. Add three pawns. Uh, move plus one range if there's no knight on the board. Remove one bishop. Add two knights. We'll do that because that actually helps me because it reduces the bishops and gives me a knight. I wonder if it's possible. Wow! Look at my look at my arc I get now. Oh! Oh, they instant kill me? Alright. I didn't know. Oh, because I revealed the piece. Yeah, okay. I did that now. Yeah, I did that to myself. <sighs> See, that's always where I mess up. It's a little stupid, like, mess up like that in this game. I've made it up as far as level 11 in it. There's 12 levels you need to go through to um, unlock the next game mode. It was. It wasn't so bad. It, it's true. It is a hundred percent true. The 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 biggest problem in the this game for me is me. <laughs> add three pentagrams. Uh, remove one bishop. Add one queen after ten turns. 
Uh, force feeding. Plus one ammo max. Reloading without moving lets you squeeze one more shell in the shotgun when it's full. Uh, remove one pawn, add one bishop, minus one ammo max. Well, that kind of negates that card, so that does me no good. Uh, and I don't like this one. Sometimes you just get the worst cards and there's just nothing you can do about it. Uh, pl minus 10 firing arc, play an extra turn when you kill a knight. Pawns can't attack diagonally, but they can attack the front two squares and set. No, no, no. Uh, we'll move plus one, flip a card if there's no knight on the board. Remove one knight, add two pawns. Pawns, uh, plus one speed. We'll do that. I don't like either of those, but. I'd rather deal with a bunch of pawns on the board. Yeah, that queen can become a problem. Uh, strife mode, right click a target and fire on your next move. Every 10 turns, plus one firepower. Let's do that. I don't, I, I'm actually not a fan of either of these options, but. I'm trying to remember. Yeah, I do get something. Alright, yeah. Oh, it just resets them. Oh, it gave me additional firepower. Alright, use a pawn soul to gain plus two firepower on your next shot. That's not bad. Remove one pawn, add one. Bishop minus one ammo max. See, I don't like that. Add two knights. Add one. Add one rook. Um, pieces minus one speed. Ugh. All right, we'll do this. I, I I actually don't like my choice either choice there. Both were pretty bad. Ah, uh, I was paying attention to the queen. Brian's watching me like fucking amateur. I think you read the effect it would cause to the CPU as it would be as it was going to be done to you. No, the black card is my card. The white card is their card. There are two cards here. Everyone, everyone gets a card. Okay, don't let me fire. It does affect me because I have to fight against it. Uh, grenades are fun. Uh, add two pots. You understand why I'm saying, like, when I say adds two pawns, adds one rook, rook minus two HP. I'm saying it sucks for me because I don't want to deal with additional pawns or rooks. Alright. Uh, wand of downpour. Deal 10 damage on random enemies. That does sound like funny. Sound like fun. Uh, although I don't know how to use it, so... We'll find out. Oh, it wasn't the reduce. It was the overall card I didn't want to deal with. 
because it might reduce like one aspect but it's probably adding it was probably adding pawns or a queen or something to that effect does that make sense Can't move there. Can't move here. I understand what you're saying now. Uh, once per floor, drag a nearby piece on your king and throw it in any direction. Drag a nearby piece in your, on your king. Once per floor, drag a nearby piece on your king and throw it in any direction. Uh, strife mode, right click a target and fire on your next turn move. Uh, add one pawn. Pawns can walk two squares on their first move. Uh, add three pawns. We'll do this. I'm not, I don't know how to use this card, but we'll, we'll figure it out. Also, how do I use this? I want to know how to use this. Can I just click it and it'll work? Oh, yeah. Uh, let's see, uh, gotta go, bye bye homos, later orange, have a good night, you just don't want to talk to orange, it's okay, you don't have to make excuses, uh, plus two firepower, flip card if you're not on the forward's edge, when you kill a piece, a rat bites the nearest target for one damage, we'll do that. Uh, undercover mission, when you reach the waypoint, choose a disruption effect and play an extra turn. I've used this one, it's a lot of fun. Add one rook, gain two ammo each time you kill a rook. See, that's not bad. Like, it at least balances out the rook. Uh, plus two firepower. I don't like this because you need to be on... Flip this card if your king is not on... Because you, it, it only works if you're on the edge. Add one queen. I don't want extra soul slot. Having one extra soul slot could be good. But we're gonna take this. I'd rather deal with a rook than an extra queen. Plus, I'll get extra ammo out of it. Oh, I'm not paying attention to where that rook is. Uh, can can I not fire at the rook? Oh no, I can throw it. Uh, that's not actually what I'm trying to do. Yeah, that's right. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. I 
wanted to try to take out that queen. Uh, I do like this, the plus 30% uh, arc, plus 2 firepower. Add one queen, queen's moves are limited to 3 squares. See, that's not so bad. Play an extra turn after using a soul card. Uh, white backups come one every turn sooner. We'll go ahead with this. I'd rather deal with that. Oh, even though they can only... Oh, that is three spaces, okay. Uh, this way. Bone. I put myself in the wrong spot. Uh, maybe the two queens was not a good call. It's gotta be wa painful watching Brian pl watch me play this. <sighs> oh, for the love of bejesus! I want the bishop soul card. That's what I was trying to do there. It lets you move like that piece. So you see how I hover over it? I can now move my king like uh, a knight. I think the bishop's better because it lets you move further on like the first turn. That's, that's why I prefer to have a bishop. But the knight soul card's good when you're like in a tight situation. Uh, use pawn soul to gain plus two firepower on your next shot. Add one bishop. Bishops can move, not attack diagonally. Ravenous rats. You kill a piece. A rat bites the nearest target for one damage. Pikemen uh, can't attack diagonally, but can move. Can attack plus two forward, plus one health. I don't like either of these. Uh, dagger, blade, plus one, minus one fire range, king, minus two HP, I don't like that. Remove two pawns, add one bishop, doubles fire arc for one bullet. Pawn can't attack you, flip this card if a pawn is killed. 
Remove one bishop, add one queen after ten turns. We'll do that. Again, not crazy about either, but... Like, sometimes it's like, what's the lesser of two evils here? Good. I just had to kill it. Uh, Non-king pieces can't come near your king. You can't escape her. Add one queen. Uh, Wand of Wrath. Deal firepower damage to a non-king target. We'll do this. So pawns can't attack me and they can't move near me. Plus one ammo max reloading without moving lets you squeeze one more shell in the shotgun when it's full. Uh, oh gosh, that's ridiculous. Um, blade plus three, queen maiden, minus two speed, queens can't take damage. I don't like that. Ugh. Both of these are horrible cards. I thought that was a king. Fuck me. Okay. Yeah, it was like imperative that I kill. Uh, I don't like that rope. Moving back is so all my. All I can do there. That actually worked out pretty well because that gives me the Rook ability, or the Rook card. There we go. I'm playing this a lot more carefully because, like, Brian's watching. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, subtle poison. Uh, king minus one HP. Queen's moves limits uh, one square per 15 turns. Queen minus one HP. Uh, court of the king. Uh, add two knights. Add one bishop. 
Add one rook, all pieces minus one speed. Your bullets have 30% chance to pierce through targets. Remove one bishop, add two knights. Um, because I kind of want to see the chaos that is going to be this board now. Oh, that was a waste then. Can't go there. No, oh, I can't go there. All right, yeah, this this is a very crowded board. This was a mistake. Seeing, I did not see that piece there. To be fair, I did that to myself because that was a pretty crazy board to like deal with. I just wanted to see what it looked like. Slow down, slows down white and black backup cards by 50%. Injured pieces lose uh, two speed. Pawn minus one HP. Release, replace rooks, knights, and bishops with a pawn after they die. Uh, every ten turns, plus one firepower, uh, plus two HP king, plus one HP queen. We'll, we'll give that a go, I guess. I don't like any of the options mo most of the time. I think an ad just started, so sorry about that. You're not missing much. Rightful courtesy, uh, plus one ammo max, 50% chance to knock back enemy. That's not so bad. Add two knights after 15 turns. Pawns can attack you. Flip this if a pawn has been killed. Add one pawn. The secret heir replaces the king if he dies. Hmm... I'm going with 
process because I don't have a lot of pawns happening right now. So that's not a huge issue. Uh, move range plus one, flip cart if there's no knight on the board. You can't escape her, uh, add one queen. Uh, flip cart if your king is not on the board's edge. We'll go with this. I kind of now realize, I think I've been misusing that card and it actually lets me, yeah, it lets me move two spaces. Which is actually really fucking nice. Oh, is it only let me do it for like a turn? It's over. See, that wasn't even that long, that bad of an ad break. Mm. There we go. She's gone. I don't have to deal with her. Uh, Nightblade, Night Bane, uh, plus three. Add one pawn, gestures can move diagonally. Uh, a gesture uh, can move diagonally and have plus two speed. Gestures past the hat when he dies. Uh, this can. Alright, we'll do that. Always get impatient. <laughs> Would you like to try? Alright, so I will try this. Let me just figure out these controls. Alright, what do I do? Yeah. It says game over. Okay, uh, just click. Not do what? over here. Click over here. Click. Yeah, there you go. Uh, try again. Yes. And so my goal is to shoot the king. Yes, kill the king. Okay, so I can't shoot anything. So how do I move? Well, I can only move one square at a time, so... Well, I know how pieces move. Oh, now what? 
Okay. Now I have to select one of these. Yeah, so they'll have bubbles and debuffs. What would you suggest? I don't know what the special moves are really, I wasn't paying attention. Okay. Yeah, but I went around them. I'm trying to save my ammo for the king. You can call me the king slayer. <laughs> Alright, what are these two? Uh, cannon fodder. Use upon soul to gain plus two firepower on your next shot. I don't know how to do that. What's that mean? You can't escape her. Oh, yeah. Well, I gotta figure out how to play with a queen. I'm gonna get a queen regardless. What's the waypoint? 
That's what I mean, yeah. Well, I don't mind that one. I like the plus two whatever firepower. But what's this one? What's what's a waypoint? Oh, so it's a way of escaping a bunch of mess. But you gotta get off to it. Oh, so it's on the board, there's gonna be a marker for and what the waypoint the is. Okay. I take the top side. So, how do I use the soul when I'm next to it? Is that it? shoot it when I'm beside it? And so how many shots do I need, or how do I tell when the king is almost dead? That's the thing, I'm not actually sure I know how the health is down there. Well, I saw the, the health of the king coming down. Yeah. Okay. I guess we'll know what the king's up is. Yeah. It looked like it was about, in that one, it was about five, I think.
Okay, so that's how it works. And this is the only one actually. Yeah, that's this is the safer one. Oh, I should have actually done this one. Oh, so if I had shot both of the knights, that would have been it? Oh, I didn't know that. I was always just going for the kill shot. You can always kill me. No, but when I killed both knights, that's when the game was over. No, there was one knight on one team. At that point, there was one left. Yeah. But I didn't kill the king. I thought it was a knight that I shot. I thought it was a... Anyways, let's see. Bloodless coup. Well, I'm also just moving rather than shooting. Just do that one, I don't know. I haven't been using these cards anyways. Oh, but these are some special uh, knights by the looks of it. that discovered uh, check so you don't want to kill that one. How did I get this music? I was wondering, it's like... On my computer, I have like a million browsers open, and sometimes they're on YouTube, and a and an ad starts up. <laughs> You're throwing me off my game. It's like Magnus Carlson. Did you hear what he went and did again? He opened his mouth. Actually, no. He used the Twitter thumbs, the X thumbs, and. Uh, yeah, this is live now, so... So, what he went and did, he lost today or yesterday or something like that. Well, what he did, he, he didn't... 
accuse the person. Now, I think, now everybody's just anxious and waiting for my next move, but you're going to have to listen to this story. And so he lost, and I'm sure the pressure to win is high at his level, and equally the desire to justify the loss might also be pretty high. So he said, oh, I lost because, yeah, I'm sounding whiny because that's what he sounded like. And uh, again, I'm not a chess player. He'll kick my ass. I get it. And he lost because he got tweaked that people around him had watches on and cell phones. Now, this is a, a legitimate concern that in the player's hall, people have electronic devices, but it threw him off his game. But like he did to see that's what I thought, making excuses. But you know, if a, if a journalist asks you a question, the first question they're going to ask is, why did you lose? So maybe he's just, he's answering the inevitable question. Alright. I'm gonna have to. Yeah, I, I agree with you. I think I gotta go after uh, Queenie here. Um, oh, why can't I? Oh, I can't shoot. Oh, I'm in trouble now. Because this is a lot of. <laughs> How do I know what my health level is? Uh, there's two shells at the top of the board next to the cockpit shells. Oh, and a mistake, it takes one away? Yeah. Oh dear. That's, that's how they damage <laughs> you. Yes, okay. are getting close to the back rank. Oh, I better Go home! Down. That's your home! Are you too good for your home? Answer me! <laughs> Why can't I shoot? Oh, lame. They promoted to a bishop? Lucky me. Yeah. Alright. Alright, let's see. Plus one ammo. I like that. Reloading without moving. I love that. All right. Had to pause. Listen up, Add Jerry. You need to change discs. These are games us dumb Americans play. If you want to get ahead of competition, you need to play what they're playing in the What Orient. is that? Do you think NBC Japan executives are playing shooting games? No. They are playing games where the spaceman finds a bunch of many men to help him. They value creativity, <laughs> and it just happens that me and Kramer found this box of GameCube so games on the street the I'll other day. I'll wait till this is finished, hey, and then I'll save my last comments. Want, but I'm gonna Magnus. need a ride to my office. So now, because of what Magnus has said, we know he's tweaked off of his game. If there's any possibility that somebody around him could cheat, so.
Yeah, so. I know, and I think if you're playing Magnus, just walk around with a limp and pretend you have a cell phone hidden in your shoe. And that's gonna. <laughs> no, there's actually a uh, a case of a of a chess player using um, some device in his shoe. Yes, he was he was busted, but we don't know exactly what it was. But just he refused to take off his shoes. All right. So what was with the knights and these? Oh. Yeah. I've already made one mistake. Careful. Oh dear, they're moving in. It's the only square I can go to. Unless I shoot it and it's killed, then I'm okay. No, it doesn't let me shoot it, and now it took a. So, pieces are wiggling. Is it just giving me a heads up about what's going to move? I, I, I suspect that's just known that. Like, they're, those pieces being nervous. You have a gun, they don't. I think it's oh. just an animation. Well, this is what I'm getting rid of. I don't think it's a telegraph. But... Oh, I'm screwed here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Okay, so now I can... start from the beginning game over it's not an easy game. <laughs> all right do you want your uh your uh, game okay. unless you want to play another game no 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 i'll let you finish i was gonna wrap up the screen <laughs> thank you everyone <laughs> let's uh <laughs> Let's give Brian a big round of applause. He was a good sport about that. GG Brian. You have you you know what? You did good for for your outing there. We'll, we'll, we'll put some hype in chat for you. Plus I spent all your <laughs> Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I'm sorry. <laughs> I unlocked the back of Brian's chair. He almost like went ass over in it um we're gonna find someone to raid all right i've recorded this a bunch of times and i don't think i'm ever gonna get it right but let's say it like this thank you so much for watching uh 
If you made it this far, please consider like, commenting, and subscribing. It really helps out my channel a lot. Um, thank you for watching. A uh, special shout out and thanks to my mods. They are amazing people. They really help out with the channel. And yeah, have a good night, have a good evening, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye everyone.